saw those multiple charges against all five former officers. But what do those felony charges mean exactly? Our Brittany Moncrease is here to make sense of them for us, especially those of us who do not have law degrees. All right, Brittany, break it down for us. Well, Richard, we know some of those charges raise many questions. So we spoke with Mid-South criminal defense attorney Claiborne Ferguson to break down what the charges actually mean and the sentences they carry. Anticipation and anxiousness. We've basically been holding our breath for the last two months. As the public waits for more information to be released in the death of Tyree Nichols, Thursday, Shelby County District Attorney Steve Mulroy announcing charges against the officers involved in the traffic stop that led to Nichols' death. The biggest charge is second degree murder. Attorney Claiborne Ferguson tells us what that carries. So the charges are very severe. The uh, second degree murder obviously is an A felony. That's 15 to 25 years in jail with no parole and no probation. So they would be serving almost a full 15 to 25 years if convicted of the second degree murder. Um, the other ones are B felonies, 8 to 12 years. Some of the lesser charges are also serious. They include official oppression, aggravated assault, and aggravated kidnapping, which many wonder what that actually means. But aggravated kidnapping is a false imprisonment. Uh, usually it would involve a deadly weapon or serious bodily injury. Unfortunately, in this case, we got both of those. The last of those charges is official misconduct. The official misconduct comes because they were law enforcement and they, they were breaking the law. It's really uh, at a state level. As the investigation plays out. Because I expect some of them to turn state's witnesses, I'm not expecting to see uh, all five of them hiding behind the thin blue line. I think we're going to see where the department and uh, other law enforcement officers will come in and testify that their behavior was way beyond the scope of uh, normal police uh, policing of our community. And Ferguson also said what stood out to him was how fast the officers were fired and charges brought forth. He said usually in these types of cases, it could take months or even years. Richard.